Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Muhammad Talib, and today I'm going to tell you about the Battle of Karbala. Say, so, what is the Battle of Karbala? Battle of Karbala is one of the most important events in the history of Islam. It left deep wound in the hearts of the Muslim Ummah. The Battle of Karbala was fought between an entourage consisting of the family members and companions of Hussein Nadirullah against the army of Yajid. It was fought on 10th of Muharram, 61-8, or 10th of October, 680 CE. It was fought at Karbala, near the river Euphrates. So why did the battle take place? What are the reasons behind this battle? After the martyrdom of Ali on the fourth caliph of Islam, there was the question who should be the next caliph. The people of Kufa wanted to make Hassan the caliph. They wanted to pay their allegiance to Hassan. But Mabia wanted to be the caliph. He thought that he was more worthy than Hassan to be the caliph. Hassan being peacemaker, did not want war and he relented by handing out powers to Mabia. But there was a treaty between Hassan and Mabia, and this treaty was known as the Hassan Mabia Treaty. According to the terms of this treaty, after Mabia, Hassan would be the next caliph. And if Hassan, if Hassan isn't alive at the time, his younger brother Hussein would be the next caliph. Hassan died. He was poisoned. And after that, Mabia made his son Yazid the Caliph. The people of Kufa paid their allegiance to Hussein, they wrote letters to Hussein, and wanted Hussein to come to Kufa as they wanted to pay their allegiance to Hussein. But now Yazid is the governor. He asked Wali, the governor of Medina, to procure allegiance from Hussein. During the night, Hussein migrated from Medina to Mecca, and while he was, he was in Mecca, he received letters from the people of Kufa asking him to come to Kufa, as they wanted to pay their allegiance to Hussein. Hussein sent Muslim bin Akhil to know about the situation. Muslim bin Akhil went to Kufa to know the situation, and he wrote a letter to Hussein that the people of Kufa were ready to pay their allegiance. Yajid knew about the presence of Muslim bin Akhil and he asked someone to kill Muslim bin Akhil. Muslim bin Akhil was killed. And Yajid also chained the governor of Kufa. About the situation, Hussein did not know anything. He continued his journey. There were almost 72 people in his entourage. He continued his journey. He did not know about the death of Muslim bin Akhil. On the 3rd of Muharram, Hussein reached Kufa and as he reached, he was surrounded by an army of 4,000 and this army was led Umar ibn Sa'd. Umar ibn Sa'd did not allow the family members and companion Hussein to take water from the Euphrates River for about two days. They stayed there without water. On the third day, her brother Hussein Abbas went with almost 50 men to take water from the river Euphrates. They were able to take only 20 sink, uh, only 20 skin of water. And while he was bringing water from the Euphrates river, Abbas was killed. On 10th of Muharram, after the Fadr prayer, the battle took place. And before the battle, Hussein gave a sermon, asked the army of Yajid to come to the path of Allah. Some of the people became ready to defend Hussein. The battle continued throughout the day, and one by one, all the companions of Hussein were killed, martyred. At last, Hussein was martyred too. Their bodies were beheaded, their heads were taken to Damascus, and the locals buried their bodies without hats there. 
सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट बैटल ऑफ करमला थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग गुड बाय